Sailing around the world is more than just the adventure of a lifetime. For our family, it's a dream come true. Before leaving Salala, we decided to explore the mountainous regions of southern Oman. We're hoping to come across some ships of the desert, or as they call them around here, Jemol. Judging from the road signs, they shouldn't be too hard to find. We stopped to take some pictures of the beautiful scenery, and the next thing we know, we're caught in the middle of a camel stampede. Well, actually, Mom is in the stampede. The rest of us got out of the way. It's hard saying goodbye to our new four-legged friends, but we need to get back to the boat and prepare for the upcoming passage. We've been to Lulu's and we have got a pile of food. I'm hoping we've got enough food to make it to Egypt. This is for the life raft. In order to get to the Red Sea, we have to sail through the Gulf of Aden, a body of water notorious for pirate attacks on cruisers. But well, this piracy is over five years, you know, from 1999 to 2005. Okay. So you have to take it in context that yeah. uh, there's only 23 incidents. So okay. were you using uh, Not all of these have been robbery or, or what have you. Some have been chases. Some have been by the uh, Yemeni patrol boats mm -hmm. where people have uh, mistaken them for uh, pirates because they weren't in uniform. There are two common strategies for negotiating Pirate Alley. You can travel in large, slower groups and find safety in numbers, or you can pair off with one other boat, go into stealth mode, and sail as fast as possible. We decide to take our chances with our friends on Balmakara. I'm ready to rock. There was a reassuring surprise waiting for us outside the harbor. Check out this aircraft carrier. It's here to protect the yachts in the Gulf of Aden. Because there are pirates in this region, we have a buddy boat. And our buddy boat is Balmakara. We watch out for them and they watch out for us if trouble happens. It's midnight and we're 40 miles off the Yemeni coast and about 15 minutes ago we just had our first encounter with pirates, or so we thought. Belmakar called us up and said that one mile ahead of us there was a radar signal from an unlit boat and it was possibly pirates. And we tell Belmakar our position, they tell us their position and finds out that we are the pirates. We had sailed past Balmakar in the dark without our running lights showing, and when they saw us on radar, they thought that we were pirates. Six days of constant vigilance in pirate-infested waters eventually gave way to utter exhaustion. When the volcanic peaks of Aden finally came into view, we breathed a sigh of relief. It's great to get this leg of the trip behind us. Join us next time as we learn that not everyone was so fortunate. There's no pretense about being fishermen or anything else. They just come right at you and shoot.